Okay, well, after about five tries, I finally got a Dragon Ball, well, Dragon Ball GT game to work. I know it's not quite what you guys wanted, but I tried to keep it right around the same thing. Um, I was going to do the Spyro, but I found this, and I was like, well, yeah, I guess it would work. So, I didn't play it for too long, because not like the other Dragon Ball Z games. It's actually a uh, side-scroller like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle old game. Um, like the older Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle game when you, when it was a side-scroller. You know what it is. I ain't gotta explain it. <laughs> but, um, I mean, as far as how it looks and how it plays, it plays really good. Like, um, it just take, because it doesn't tell you any of the controls. It's pretty much like, hey, figure it out, you can do it, so I had to, I had to figure it out, and I know some of you probably wanted to like read the little saying and all, what they're saying and stuff all at the beginning, but I skipped a lot of it because I just, I've had such a trouble making this video that I just wanted to get it done, um, I know it's not that great of a quality, um, hopefully I can figure out something that'll make it better next time, um, I'm going to post a, in, on my personal page, I'm going to post the links to where I get my emulators and where I get my ROMs. Um, obviously, you got to be safe about most places where you do that because a lot of places will give you viruses. Um, as far as the Players Union, they're trying to avoid any kind of copyright issues, so we're just going to keep it that way. Um, as far as the Players Union one goes, I will, however, have the... Um, what's the word the link the link to my personal youtube account and uh you can if you if you still want to you can go there and you know click on my link um of course like the video comment if you'd like i don't care you can say my voice sounds stupid i got curly hair and i have no soul but it's cool um like i said i'm not really good at the whole commentary thing i'm, I'm this is the first real video like this i've made um I did put a lot of time into it, as much as it doesn't seem like it. it's only an eight minute video, so yeah. Um, I did work really hard on getting it pulled together though, I mean it's not much, but it's what I could pull off. Hopefully you guys still enjoy it, I mean like I said, it's not a lot of gameplay, uh, which is really not my fault, the game was mostly talking at the beginning. Here you can see what I mean by it's a side scroller, it's kind of just like, I don't even know, it's, it's, it's weird how it's set up, like. And I didn't even learn how to use a blast until, like, the end. <laughs> cool little spin thing at the end there. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I don't know if you guys know this or not, but kind of a big deal. <laughs> but uh, on another note, as you guys watch the gameplay, I would like to uh, give a shout-out to Jake. And Well, first off, I'm sorry if I pronounced anyone's name wrong. But uh, Jake, uh, Elias, uh, Pacoon, I think is how you pronounce it. Um pretty much anybody that was there to help make the players union um, you guys have been great um, a lot of good videos have come out of it so far and I just felt like I had to con contribute something but anyway I just want to give a quick little shout out to all of them um, you guys do a great job running the pages uh, which on the players union YouTube account which you may have stumbled across because of this video um, there's links to the MySpace page, the the Twitter, so forth and so on. Um, and definitely, uh, definitely add, share, tweet, whatever. Uh, do something at us. <laughs> we uh, we're always talking to people. We're just as long as you're open-minded and you're not a troll, you'll, you'll fit in great. Um, but anyway, back to the what I do with video games, or in this case, a ROM. Um, for, until I get a capture card, I'm just going to be reviewing ROMs, and I'm going to review them as ROMs, not as the game, so don't get y'all's panties in a bundle if you don't like what I say about it. Um, as far as this game goes, I didn't, like I said, I didn't play a lot of it, but what I did play of it, if you're into side-scrollers, I'd give it a 7 out of 10, but me, like I said, I'm not into side-scrollers, so... Oh, yeah. I'm going to get a lot of hate for this. Uh, minus the fact of what the game is, I give it a 5 out of 10. Uh, not because I hate it. Uh, it's just, like I said, I'm not a big fan of 
side scrollers, and they shouldn't try to change. Um, everybody knows Dragon Ball Z is usually more of a free roamish, like you can walk around, whether it be an overhead, over you know, third person or first person. And then they just tried to side scroller with this game, and I mean, honestly, it's not horrible, but it's not my thing. So, like I said, if you like side scrollers, then this game is definitely a seven out of ten for you. If you don't, it's more of a four or five out of ten. Um, I'll be generous; I'll give it a five out of ten. Um, and when I review these ROMs, I am going to mention the games that I've came across in the past that I just I cannot stand. Um, it's going to be I'm trying to think of a fanciful name for it. John's bad review of the week. <laughs> um, the first game I'm going to mention that's just god awful. And if you if you like it, please please send me a message, talk to me, explain to me why you like it. Because I can't I can't comprehend why anyone would like it. It's a game called Siren. It was for the PS2 and Xbox. I don't know if it's for anything else. I know I played it on PS2. Um, I just that game was so horrible. Uh. Like I said, I give it a 2 out of 10, and the only reason I give it a 2 out of 10 is because the graphics are pretty decent for their time. They're not, like, incredible graphics, but I will be fair and say they did do good as far as that goes. Um, ooh, not hit combo. Anyway, <laughs> but that's that's my bad review of the week. Um, but like I said, if you're into side scrollers, this is definitely a, a game to try out, whether you want to go and try to buy it online it's called dragon ball gt transformation um you can either buy it online or you can you know uh, use an emulator i i would probably enjoy it more if i was on a, on on an actual game boy advance like one of the retro big bulky ones or maybe an even an sp i don't know but uh, i'm it's coming close to the end here um i get well it's not that i get destroyed i just i love how, like one of them looks like a wolf. It's so weird. Anyway, I love how they just walk off and leave the little girl. It's like, hey, Pan, go deal with it. <laughs> but no, um, like I said, if you're into side scrollers, though, this is definitely a game. If you're into Dragon Ball Z or GT, and you like side scrollers, this is a game. Um, but me, on the other hand, I'm not really a big fan of side scrollers. I did play it, like I said, for about eight or nine minutes here. Um, Aunt Pan died. Anyway, right here you can see where I figured out how to do the blast here in just a minute. Oh, 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 oh. trying to shake them off and then right there. See it? Yep. Yeah, big fail because I just died. <laughs> but anyway, it's been great. See y'all later.